I think we're good. Okay. What's this? Attention! Laboratory! Attention! Laboratory! Attention! Custom cast mode. How about unicorn? Huh? Not that one. Not any of those. No, just the one which is like not DLC. Look, all of these DLCs have arrived. How can you tell which is DLC? We want... Because it says DLC on the little thing, look. They all say DLC. Oh. And we haven't got it. So right. th I'm thinking... It's one of these. Okay, which one are we going to do? That's Audrey that's or the bird from the Kshatriya? Um, I think that's a cutscene. Yeah. yeah. Alright, cutscene! <laughs> Japanese is good, guys. Yeah, I hope your Japanese is good, guys, because now is the time you've been training for. <laughs> you okay? Ah, <laughs> oh, senpai! <laughs> it's so funny. I love this stuff. I'm, uh, I'm not racist. I love Japan and Japanese culture. Mate, are you Japan enough for this cutscene? <laughs> I can't Japanese. <laughs> says. <laughs> it's okay. We're going to let it get you through this. All right. Once there was a space station, and on that space station, there was a flag, and the flag blew in the wind, even though there wasn't any air. Things were, really sad. Things were sad. It was fire. It was, it was burning. They burnt the flag. The flag burned, and it was sad. Um, other humans. They were attacked by hu other humans. Basically, people were killing people for reasons unbeknown to people. For, you know. And Audrey is the daughter of the old leaders of the re uh, rebellion against the government. Basically. Ish. Sort of. Kinda. Not really. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's the end of the cutscene. So yeah, basically, you know, she's got a lot, of sh lot to deal with, and uh, where, where yeah. Are, where are the missions in this? Doesn't that say DLC? Get back to the fight. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna create an account with the Japanese store because I want all this DLC. Mate, if you, the only way you can get the DLC is if you have an account that was made in Taiwan or Hong Kong. The account holder has to be of residence in Hong Kong or Taiwan. So yeah, um, you want to rent a condo so we can get this DLC? It's not a problem, bro. <laughs> okay. Alright. Oh, action! Yeah! It's the Garanziers. Look at that spaceship! It's a cargo ship, by the way. <laughs> yeah, guess what the cargo is? Gundams? Wow, well, it's not really a Gundam, but it's still badass. It's like an Uber Zaku. A quad wing. Oh, baby. Let's go. Let's take them down. They're going to be fighting back this time, so uh, I'm in trouble. It's time to go nuts. Have it. Oh, 
Oh, he got close to me. Oh, he got me. Oh boy. I feel. Whoa. Jesus. Oh my god. I want those missiles. <laughs> they looked awesome. Yeah, I'm doing it. He's done. Supply. So good, I got a pass. And a buttload of cutscenes. Yay! So all those other characters' story arcs, that's all DLC. Yeah. That's <laughs> kind of annoying. Yeah, I know, I know. <laughs> so much DLC. Look at this awesome space colony. Wouldn't you want to live in there? Uh, someone can live there. <laughs> Yeah, if I have my own spaceship, I'm down. Sold. <laughs> yeah. Uh oh. Bad times. It used to be so easy when I was at school. Now I have to pilot this Gundam. Gah. <laughs> it's really smelly in here. No one ever cleans it. They never told me to use the Kleenex. Well, it's true. Who cleans the Gundams? They must get really smelly after, like, 50 episodes of Teenage Boy, like, just fighting in it. Oh, yeah, true. They had a ship and a crew, and they do it. No, Wing. Wing. Which is the one where the guy has to try to kill himself. I think that was Gundam Wing. Yeah. Hero Yui, the most <laughs> badass pilot of their all time, just has a death wish. Mission, <laughs> Mission accomplished. <laughs> Boom. Blows himself up. <laughs> uh, okay. Hop. Let's see. More emo kid. <laughs> Banaja. I want more missions. <laughs> Banaja. You don't understand. Look. But I got shot in the nuts. Right in the... <laughs> Look, more pictures of the unicorn on the wall. I have a family obligation to pilot this Gundam. Also plot. Do you remember the plot? I, um... Yeah, the plot was awesome, actually. I'm only, ma I'm only joking around, because I don't... I, you know, in a way, this is better, because you don't get any spoilers. Even though you get to see it all. <laughs> and they're basically telling you everything, but don't get it. She's the pilot of the fort of the quad wing. Oi, you lot in the chat, stop slapping each other with fish. <laughs> they're, they're a fun bunch. Says... And slapping him around with a large trout, apparently, is what it says here. Oh! More stuff! Things! Emotions! 
Oh, more emotions. Oh God. We have to get the emotions done to get the next fight. That's how it works with Gundam. <laughs> <laughs> Look at all that beautiful DLC. I know, we could have just fighting it. Why can't I play the DLC? Ah. Look, more weird neck girl. She has got a weird neck and a very big head. She is furious. I wouldn't want to get involved in that, you know. By the way, that wasn't a bike helmet in his hands. It was a harrow. Oh, the the Gundam yeah, yeah. equivalent of an iPhone. Yeah. See, in the future, iPhones are balls that can fly and say, Harrow! Because it's so Japan. I love them. Oh, more emotions! Okay, come on. Wait for it. <gasps> That's a big explosion. Someone's shooting at a bridge. Mechs are fighting, yeah! I see our, our quad wing. Wait, what? Why is Harrow... He left Harrow behind. Not cool. Look, Harrow. He looks determined. Our hero. He's gonna beat them all. With his Gundam! With his emotions, should emo kid. Look, look, it's the reflection. She's checking herself out. So vain. Oh, please, no more emotions. Now we have to hear Audrey's side of the tale. I know. <laughs> Mate, you will understand this plot. You, you will. Listen, you don't just get to fight with mechs, okay? No. No! You must learn the emotion and the drama, okay? Look, they're little kids and they never loved before and they're holding hands. Look, it's so emotional. Look, don't worry, I'll protect you even though I don't know who you are and we've only been in this show for a few seconds. But I'll protect you with my harrow. It's actually a really good show. I'm only making fun of it because we're having fun and it's in the wrong language and we don't really know what they're saying. Well, I do know what they're saying, kind of. Yeah, totally. Yeah, I get it. She was telling us that that was a prologue for the next speech, okay? Listen, they're just trying to understand why they have to fight giant robots. And what's the deal with the unicorn? Because it's cool, yeah! <laughs> yes, this is in an English dub. However, this game is not. <laughs> and there presents the issue. But it's fun. Look! Look at the, this having so much fun. I remember this scene. This is, this is a good scene. This is the only game I've ever reported at. I'm still chuffed. It's probably the best anime game tie-in you'll find. Despite the fact that it's not in English. It still is. Yeah, especially for Gundam, because most of them are slow, and this was made by, um, oh, who made this game? Let's see. No, it's not Havoc Studios, there's another name for the developer, it's like First Something. The actual developer isn't on the back of the box? They must have been proud of it. It's the same people that did a whole bunch of other games. Oh man, who was it? Oh I really want to know who it is Maybe now. Was it the... first, next, or something, or next? Uh, I can't remember. Maybe we try going for, um... Mate, oh, we're, going all we're just have to watch it. If you watch it, it unlocks it. That's what I worked out. This is why I stopped playing it last time, because I was just like, oh my god! I have already watched the show. That's why I bought the game. I didn't buy the game to watch the show again, even though this might give another view of it that you didn't get from the show. But I didn't need that. I just wanted the game. just want to find the mechs. And no, it's not skippable. <laughs> 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 
You asked for this. You will watch it all. You will. You will. <laughs> Look, right, we have to justify the uh, cost of the game with all this content. Which is basically like a slideshow version of the anime <laughs> that you already watched. <laughs> Wait for it. Oh my god. Hey mate, look, look, there's gonna be some cool okay. cool mechs. Yeah, like we it, like giant robots. Listen. Seriously? Come on, I need more pictures. Like I think it's because of the age as well. Like now they'd probably just put the whole show in as well. Mm. You know? Look, it's skipped so much stuff out. We've been through loads of fights that we haven't been allowed to fight. I know where we are in the plot. There's no, like, you know, we've skipped a whole bunch of fights to get to where we're at. Okay. Right, developer from soft from software. Yeah, look up from software. Find out who, what. Yeah, someone look up from software on your uh, search. There, we'll do a bit of cross referencing here. Probably Omega. <laughs> They do stuff like that. Put references in everywhere. From software. Yeah, yeah, from software. Yeah, look up other games that they've done. From software is a Japanese video game company founded in 1986. What are they famous for? It's known primarily for. Armored Core. Armored Core. Demon Souls. Demon Souls. Dark Souls. Dark Souls. Kingsfield. Kingsfield. Otagi, which is I think a game with a dog. Yeah. That awesome yeah. game. And Tenchu. And Tenchu. Uh, Tenchu. Oh my god, I love that game. See, this Gundam game was made by the Armored Core team. That's why it's got the best mech combat out of all of them. Because it's actually Armored Core Gundam Edition. <laughs> Uh, however, Sunrise probably insisted that they shovel all this filler in. This is game filler, man. Like, I already watched the show. There's been more filler than, than game so far. Way more filler than game. Like, do we get mission two now? Oh my god! Are we missing something? No, we're not missing anything. This is like... A... Okay, guys, I'm sorry on the stream, guys. Basically... I probably won't edit this out because this is the game. Gameplay, 10 out of 10. W would buy. <laughs> However, it probably needs a little bit more interaction. Yeah, I'm, uh, I love Gundam, so I don't regret buying the it's still really cool though, if you're just sat there and you want to get into a Gundam experience, this is doing it, so. I know there's a, there's a sword fighting mechanic in this game that I've seen as well, where you can actually can crash, crash the swords. Mmm. Oh, you can do that in this, but the controls are really weird. It's, it's like they, um, it's, it's, it's like they added, um, it's like this was made for a coin-op. Because the way that you have to keep jolting the yeah. stick and pressing a button, it's not like I'm actually steering the, the mech. Mm. It's more like I've got a coin-op joystick. Yeah. And I'm hitting buttons and bashing the stick either direction and combos and whatnot. Yeah! Finally, a mission! I'm just going to make sure it's still recording. Let's reset it for the next episode. There we go. Finally, a mission. Okay, guys. We're going in. Look at all the cutscenes we had to watch. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven cutscenes. Damn! <laughs> it's like, ram that plot right down your throat. 
Like, you couldn't do this with an in-game message or something? Just, like, spread it out or something? About the music? Maybe tell me to go and buy the series, watch that, then come back and get... Mm. <laughs> well, it's also, they haven't used animation, they've used stills. The yeah, the, the stills, that's what does it to me. It's like, come on, it was an anime already. It can't have been that difficult to anim animate the cutscene. <laughs> it's great. Like it's not even a cutscene. It's an or it's a commentary of a screenshot. Mm. <laughs> we have to go through and load each. Oh. Okay. What the hell's going on? I'm already in the Mac. Huh? Mm. This is awesome. Wait, what? Oh, I'm in Kshatriya still. Huh? Can we what? Can we switch to first person? I don't know. I hope, I wish we could. That was weird. Oh, we're inside the colony. Dude, this is badass. Sorry. Select. Select actually. No, it didn't. It just selected the next target. You want to play it here? Oh man, this thing is a bit of a nightmare to actually do close combat in. Because there's a dude behind me. There he is. Can't get him. Come on, get your swords out, woman. I <laughs> can't do it. Hey. I think that was just for the Gundam. It's sort of like a different, a different move set. Oh, well done, mate. You, you, you shot the colony. It's all going to fall apart now. Uh oh. Now that was a cutscene. Yeah. Ah. Oh, she's good. Skills. Bada. Oh shit. Off we go. Oh dear. Shimata. Nero Gomari 
Oh no! No 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 no! How did I die? Where was my HP gauge? Sorry, I should have just wait. Retry. I hope is the first first option because is. I think retry is the first option. We're okay. Yes, we can. Come on, do your thing. Oh my god. Oh my. I think we're getting that Camele system down. She's relentless. <laughs> yeah, that was fun. She kicked some serious ass. Like, basically, guns were not the way forward with that one. <laughs> oh, nice. Screw the cutscene. We got the chat. The chat. Yeah, yeah, people are being pretty quiet right now. Okay.